Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve if your VPN is not working properly on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process, guys. Obviously, the first thing you want to make sure your credentials you're using when you input it into your network settings is correct and the correct credentials. You want to make sure that's, you know, should be number one. So if it was working properly, you know, yesterday and it's not working right today, then obviously that's going to be a little bit more of a complicated solution, but it shouldn't be too bad. And we're going to start by opening up the search menu, type in control panel. Best result, check them back with control panel. So go ahead and open that up. Set your view by to large icons. And then you want to select where it says network and sharing center. Underneath internet type, you want to click on whatever hyperlink is selected here. And you want to select the properties button. Where it says internet protocol version 6, and then in parentheses TCP slash IPv6. Uncheck that and then select OK. And once you're done with that, close out of here and restart your device. And hopefully I should have resolved the problem. If you're just looking to reset your network settings as well and then potentially reinsert the credentials, you can try that as well. And you can do that by opening up the search menu and type in settings. Best result should say settings. Go ahead and open that up. Go ahead and left click on network and internet on the left side. And then on the right side, you want to scroll down and select advanced network settings. Scroll down again underneath more settings and select network reset. Reset all network adapters to factory settings. Go ahead and left click on that. So this will remove and then reinstall all of your network adapters and set other networking components back to their original settings. You might need to reinstall other networking software afterwards, such as VPN client software or virtual switches. Your PC will be restarted. Make sure you have your Wi-Fi credentials nearby. And make sure you get them off the router if you don't have them accessible, because once you restart after selecting Reset Now, you will need to enter back in those credentials. If you're using an Ethernet-based connection, you don't have to do that, obviously, but go ahead and select Reset Now. Select Yes, and you will have five minutes to restart your computer, so just make sure you save and close out of any open programs and applications and restart your device. And there you go, guys. Hopefully that should have resolved the problem. Hopefully, at least at this point, you should be able to have internet access. And then if you have to enter back in your VPN credentials, you should be able to do that. So, as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.